Well, maybe you picture yourself at retirement kind of, you know, sitting back, relaxing, maybe playing golf whenever you can. Maybe you're already there. Well, for one Roseville couple, that just won't do. They are spending their retirement years crisscrossing the globe, volunteering their time, feeding their soul. Joining us is Virginia and Louis Pierce, Fox 9's Global Volunteers of the Month. And thank you so much for coming on the show today. Now, you, the two of you, have been traveling the globe since the 70s, but we're going to focus on, because we go, go on and on, but we're going to focus on some more of your recent travels. In fact, we're going to start with, this was a trip to China, and Louis, you'll see a picture here of uh, you with some, some children in China. Uh, what did you do there? And who are those kids? This is a sp special project that uh, Global Volunteers has in a small community south of Xi'an in China. And um, they are building the state-of-the-art elementary school. It's in a community called Anshan. And this was started in 2002. And those of us that were teaching in Xi'an had the, the uh, possibility of going down there and visiting this school. And this was uh, taken with a group of children that were part of the big, big village celebration. Look at the big smiles. And Virginia, you're, you're a retired teacher, I understand. And you spent um, some time teaching English in Poland. Yes. Uh, let's take a look at a picture here. And what was it like teaching? It was conversational English. Yes, they all students. have studied English, you know, in school for years. But in many countries, they don't have the opportunity to practice speaking it, and they're afraid to try it, and so forth. So the purpose of the program is to give them as many opportunities as possible to use their English. And so each of us had groups of four or five kids, and. Um, Mine were fairly fairly good, although the young girl in my class was kind of shy and had the least English ability. And uh, But she tried, and she worked hard, and by the end of the session, she was translating for me. Is that right? Wow. Mm -hmm. well, that's quite a jump. Louis, you're a retired dentist, and I yes. understand that you've done some dental work. Um, there's a picture here of you in Calderon. What kind of work were you doing there? Well, in Calderon, I was doing uh, dental work on preschool and elementary school kids. Um, Global Volunteers again is invited into this country to do uh, different kinds of uh, work um, and this is in a low income area and... Uh, I'm guessing a lot of the kids do not have access to dental care. They don't care. have access to dental care and it was very highly organized. Uh, we were invited in by the host country uh, representative of the organization is called the Women of Calderon. And Calderon is a community just outside of Quito, Ecuador. Ecuador, right. Mm -hmm. All right, now you've traveled, both of you, with your grandson <coughs> to Poland, I understand. And, and this is something that you're hoping to do with all of your grandkids. Uh, yes. it, it, this is your grandson, Michael, okay. and here you are in Poland. And, and what, was, what did he add to your experience? Well, plus Bringing the pleasure of just spending two weeks with him. We were so proud because uh, he was offered the opportunity to teach his own class in the Poland program. So he had a class of five students, and he just was very competent in doing that. And uh, the, he got along well with them and also, you know, figured out the role of a teacher versus the role of a friend when they were hanging out. So it was yeah. really a real joy to to see him do that. Yeah, I'm sure it is. And we're taking him and his sister to Italy for another conversational English program this summer. Well, we are doing such great work and we appreciate you coming on the program today to talk about it and hopefully if you're out there and you're wanting to do something, as we call it, the, the vacation that feeds the soul, Global Volunteers is the place to go. Uh, Lewis and Virginia Pierce, thank you so much for coming on the show today. And if you are interested in becoming a Global Volunteer, you can log on to globalvolunteers.org or you can visit our website at fox9.com.